Hello guys, I am Shahzad and uh, welcome in lecture number 7. Today we are going to discuss about the Google, Google tools. Let's suppose if you have the website like this, this is the shakesy.com, that how can you calculate uh, that how many users currently available are accessing your websites and how many users uh, accessed your website uh, before 10 before 10 days ago or one month ago and how can you determine that which keyword people are using in your area in your country so these are the questions you have to ask so uh, you cannot do this by manually you have to need some tools so google has some tools seo google's tools so as you can see we have the webmaster tool we also have the AdWord Google Google AdWords. So as you can see, this is the Google AdWords. We use this tool when whenever we need any kind of keyword information. So now as you can see, this is your Google My Business. Whenever I search ShakeZ, so now as you can see the the map and also some informations showing here so how can you do that you can just create the my business account and add your uh, descriptions working hours and some other informations here oh you also have google adsense we are not going to talk about the google adsense okay now what so this is the tool which called google webmaster tool you can we also have analytics analytics google.com so now as you can see <coughs> it's showing me on the search google.com which is the google console okay now it's showing me the overall performance of the particular websites that how many keywords ranked on the first position first positions so now as you can see if i click on the digital sort so as you can see uh, if i click on the average position so now as you can see i have two keywords so marketing agency two keywords ranked on the first position of the google so these are the impressions that uh, how many times people find this content okay now google analytics you can track the user activity by using the google analytics so now as you can see currently i have two users active on my website so now as you can see i i also have the data country wise user time wise traffic channel and something like that we'll discuss about these tools in our later lectures but for now these are the tools we are going to use or if you want if you want to work uh, on seo you have to familiar with these tools but don't worry we are going to discuss about these tools in our later lecture so i hope you are enjoying this series if you think we are doing good feel free to share our courses and also the videos and don't forget to click on the subscribe button so you never miss the update. So thank you for watching.